special guest entering the arena. Welcome everyone to the front room and welcome to another adventurous day with Greg and Clark. Today, we are gonna be going up to camp and sleeping in a tent as requested by Clark Man as a part of Guys Week. But that's not all we're doing up there. We're also taking Roxy Aww. and we're also taking this, which is our brand new RC boat that I bought. This is our first like really good boat and I'm excited to take it out today. But before we do that, we have to do an unboxing. Unboxings tend to get a little difficult when there's feet wrapped around it. But as you may or may not be able to tell, this is a Traxxas Blast. And I was looking all over for a decent boat and this seemed to be the one to get. So let's crack into this Clark man and see what this bad boy looks like. Hopefully somewhat similar to what you see on the front here. And uh, I don't plan to save the box, so we'll just cut right across there. Shred into it. Go ahead. Wow. Should just slide right off here. There it is. Oh, look at that. Lovely. <laughs> I wish Clark loved me as much as this boat. I'm kidding, of course, but there you go. Let me see the back of that. Oh my gosh. That looks pretty serious. Yep. We, of course, have the standard issue Traxxas transmitter, which I'll, I guess, need to get some batteries to put in there. And we've got a thing for the antenna. So that just goes on top of that. And what's this? Oh, is this a little stand for it for when you're not using it? You can set it on this thing. Okay, okay. They say the bigger your antenna, the more serious you are. And uh, this one's definitely got that. Let's see if we can find the battery, which should be inside here. There's a rubber band holding that on. I don't know if that's supposed to be there or not, uh, but our battery is under the front of this. But underneath here, you can see all of the motor work. There's some paper in here and our battery is up in the front under there, but here's the charger. So we can just probably charge it with the battery staying inside. Look inside that. Oh my gosh, beautiful. <laughs> this looks like something that's probably gonna get destroyed today, but we'll be very careful, hopefully, and this thing will come back in one piece. Before we do all that, we have to actually go to camp. We got the boat in here charging and not the most conventional pack job on camp, but I think we got everything that we need. Just the essentials mainly. You guys ready for some adventure? Uh -huh. By the time we get up to camp, our boat should be good to go. We're coming up on Clark Man's favorite part of the journey to camp. And that is this bridge. bridge. Here we go. It isn't really red anymore though. I think it's rust. It's Let's rust see what the creek looks like. Oh man. The creek is up today. Holy smokes. Really? Yeah. Maybe we should have brought an actual boat instead of an RC boat. We got a water crossing. Dang. The creek's so high, it's decided to come up on the road. <laughs> That's crazy. Roxy's getting hyped. There's camp right up there. Pap's doing the weed whacking. We'll just pull it in right here, boys. Welcome to camp. Come on out, Roxy Bear. There's Mick. <laughs> He's ready. I lost my goggles at the pool. And also, I need this for you. Drawing. Thank you. That's amazing. He's is, been holding that the whole way up here to get to you. Is that a mountain? Is, are these people climbing the mountain? No, that's people driving down the mountain. And then that car catched on fire. The treasure catched on fire. We have to put out and it says water on there. <laughs> that's good to know. That's crazy. Usually there's like half of this is rocks going out here. And then it gets a little deep back there by those big rocks. We'll see if Roxy can even make it back. <laughs> Bear, swim this way. <laughs> Uh-oh. Roxy, come. come on. I don't know if she's smart enough to come out. Come on, Rox. Swim this way. Come on, Bear. Oh, I think she's good. I think she's got it. Yeah, bear. You did it. Holy. I've never seen it like this. Not in July. Usually you can walk all the way out there. Yes. I don't want to put it too far out in the water. We'll never see Roxy Bear again. Oh, 
She got me. Hey, you should try this thing out. What thing? This swing. It's gonna start spinning back. Really? Oh, no. Who needs to go to Knoebels? We've got camp. when you come back up. Yes! Two high fives. Oh, I left you hanging. This is scary. It looks fun, actually. Why? Why are you like super dogs? No! <laughs> Why? Oops, stop it. Okay. I hate that hedgehog! I think our dream of putting the boat in down there is probably not going to work, but we still have the big hole that we can try out. But first, we have some lunch. There's a big hole. Is Pap in there? Yep, Pap's in here. Oh yeah, I gotta show him our boat. Try to get as much video of this as I can because if it goes in the water, we're probably never gonna see it again. It's our new boat. Did you try it? No, not yet. We're, we're going gonna to put though. it out there. I hope it's got power. I know, that's the thing. I've never used it before and I hope this isn't the last time we see it. Pap's gonna be real excited about these here cookies that Cody made and also got some fruit salad that I made below there and a bunch of stuff falling out of the truck. Hello, beasts. Hey, you guys, that's a new one. They're having chocolate. That's what doggies do. It's Ooh, mix like right up on the edge there. Yeah. You hear the rip. I hear it. Oh! Decapitated. We're gonna drive down here and check out the big hole, which is our swimming spot, to see if there's any opportunities for us to swim and or run the Traxxas boat. Let's see if we can find a spot to put the truck down here. Yeah, we're going down there. Yeah, this looks like a good spot to leave it. Right here. Oh boy. A little off-road action for you guys. <laughs> Mom's like, what'd you do to my truck? We're off road, woman. She's gonna fall right out of the truck. There's the man. The man, the myth. The legend. <laughs> Rox is already down there. Ooh, we could do some rock crawling through here. This is pretty good. Surprise, this isn't underwater. The thing that I love most about coming out here in a new season is that Roxy always seems to know her way. <laughs> She's going out here. This is completely different than it has been in previous seasons. Just follow the bear. She knows her way to water. We're here. The big hole. Bigger than ever, I feel like. But we still have a spot out here. I was expecting this all to be under. Roxy, loving it out here. You think we could do this, Clark, man? Yeah, yeah. With the water level confirmed, we head back to the truck to get our suits on and to grab the boat because I'm gonna try it out out here. We got swim shorts. We got boats. Roxy, we got Roxy's leaving. Okay, bye, bear. She's like, what? <laughs> I'm in my weirder shoes. Perfect. How cold do you think this water is going to be? I don't know. Give it a shot. See how it is. Oh, it's cold. Is it freezing? Yep, it's cold. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's cold, cold, cold. <laughs> sure this is a great idea? I don't know. I have my goggles. Roxy seems to be doing okay out there. <laughs> oh, man. boat in. Gonna need all chocolate labs to evacuate the area. I guess here we go. See if we get off the rocks a little bit. Alright, thanks Roxy. Mm -hmm. It works. <laughs> thanks Roxy. 
All right, do I get a little more dangerous and send it out there? Clark, you my recovery team? I'm gonna give it a go. Roxy! Roxy in my shot. Let's see how things look in here. Pretty good, nothing stuck in the back just yet, so that's a good sign. Last. Oh, I just got it. <laughs> what do you think of the boat, Clark, man? It's nice. Yeah. It's got some power. Oh, gosh. Hey, Roxy, come here. What do you got? <laughs> Scuba Steve in control here. Okay, go ahead. Woo. I feel like she's starting to slow down a little bit. Probably don't want to wear it down too much and then not get it back because if this battery dies out there, that thing's going down the creek and we're probably not going to get it back. <laughs> not too bad. After delving into the world of RC planes, it feels weird to go out with a new RC and actually get it back today, but the boat world seems to be a lot easier and it's just as fun. I love coming out with anything RC and giving it a blast out here, literally, and having a rip on things. And, just having a good time. So that's going to conclude this little portion of the boat tour. I think we'll probably be doing a lot more of this. I would be more comfortable if the water wasn't so high and if I knew what happened exactly when the uh, battery died because I don't want to lose this. That would make me very sad. So at least we got out and we got a little bit of a run in. Uh, I didn't think it was going to happen based on the water level, but I'm not too bad in here and it did a good job fighting the current up until towards the end there where I felt like it was slowing down a bit and it happened very quickly. So I would recommend if you are getting one of these, I would recommend getting at least one extra battery so you can swap them out. You don't want to go out and just have 15 minutes on the water. You want to be out there a lot longer than that, I would assume. So get some extra batteries in your life. On that bombshell, I'm getting a little sweaty out here. How cold is the water, Clark, man? Really cold. Ready? Yeah. Oh, no. We might be losing Roxy Bear here. Roxy, come this way, girl. Come on, Bear. We might be losing her. She's coming back. Oh my gosh, she is sailing across there. Yeah, she's good. Scared me a little bit there. Look at this dog. You're rubbing against the bushes. The bushes. How do I dry off in these rocks? I'm gonna rub on these bushes. That was a pretty fun little water day there. Uh-huh. I enjoyed this, bro. Me too. Thanks for coming along. I love camp. It's so fun. Me too. Oh, 
There she goes again. As Greg and Clark make their way back to civilization with their dog, Roxy Bear, they see the truck in the distance and run enthusiastically towards it. Since we don't have any towels, this is how these guys are going home. Let's take her back to camp. Here we go. Back on the main road. Everyone's still alive back there. Yes. What'd you think, Bear? I was playing Mario tunes in the, ba in, in the back. I heard it. You heard the Mario music. Come on, Bear. Oof. Oof. <laughs> Who trying, got my bed all muddy? I, I was trying to act like Spider when I jumped out there. Yeah, fun time. It was awesome, other than the water being ice cold. Oh, was it? Yeah. It's now much later. I took a pretty substantial nap out here and uh, just enjoying everything. Listening to some music. We got Clark Man here. This is not any regular water bottle. It has holes on the top. Oh my gosh. I put those holes in with sticks and toothpicks. And what's the goal of that? It's not, it's, a, it's supposed to be a watering can, but instead it's shaped like a water bottle. What else have you been up to while I've been sleeping out here? Digging a hole over there in the dirt pile. Okay. What else? Um, wet dookie. <laughs> A.K.A. Bobby Dookie. What else? <laughs> and watched Bob the Builder. Wow. You've had quite the productive afternoon while I slept. And showed Dad this. Okay. And then here I am showing it to you guys. Wow. That's really cool. And that's what I've been doing while Daddy been on. Yeah, I was, I was just like, I started Z's. watching like a YouTube video and then I'm just like, Z's coming out of dad. There's Z's coming off me, but I feel great now. Probably not going to be able to sleep tonight hey, though. What? I want to show you something. Do I have to get up? Yeah. <laughs> I'm on like one of these, uh, one of these like chairs. It's like, let me see if I can show you. It's like one of these, these things. My neck is like really stiff right now. I think I'm getting old. Ugh. Are you going to make me look at some hole or something you dug out here? Mm. Please tell me that's not the case. Not, not okay. Um, All right. Here. That's the hole? Yeah, here's the big rock we found. Okay. In that big hole right there. Do I, should I get a close-up? Yep. Okay. It's me and Yami's progress. So what's the goal here? What, what are you making? We're making a cool, like, house hole. For Andrew's trying to get out like all the rocks. Don't you touch that purple plant over there? It's a weed to ease a like it. Okay. He's like those weeds don't touch it because her friend um said um they um they hurt, so don't touch it. Okay, I won't. I was going to, I was I was heading over there right now to touch it. No, Dad, no. <laughs> okay, I won't. This is a sunflower plant. There's all kinds of flowers from sunflower guys. Okay. And there's another butterfly plant. Butterfly bush? Yep. Oh, I see the bees on it. Let me see if I can get a closer yeah, to the bees. there's the weed. Oh it's my gosh. Weed. They're really on that, aren't they? Yeah. Wow. Really like I really don't like bees very it's, much. It's a weed. Yeah. It's a pony stabby weed. Don't even touch it. Hurts. Wow. It's all jaggy. Pretty cool. Now we're out of focus. Oh, look at this. That's a nice thing to wake hot up to. Dogs. Wow. That's a lot of hamburgers. Four hot dogs and dipped hamburgers. Dang. And corn in the cob. Corn in the cob. Almost time to eat. I didn't realize how late it was. Look at this guy. He's worse than I am. Oh, look at Bear in that sunlight. Boo boo. Watch this, guys. Oh. Can we get a demo of that thing? This plant's dying. So that's your invention? Yep. It's a watering can. Wow. Water all over these beautiful flowers. I'm glad you made that. That's a handy tool. Yeah. It also can be a drinking vessel. <laughs> okay. Delicious. Look at the steam coming off of that corn. Oh. Wow. Go right through that into the burgers. Hot dogs. Through the steam. He's awake. He lives. 
with dinner finished and the sun setting in the sky, we turn our attention to the back of the truck where our $5 yard sale tent waits for us. We've used this thing a few times up here and tonight's gonna be another one. This time though, we have a bit of an upgrade. Got a queen size blow up mattress to put inside there. So we're gonna be super comfy. And there is our tent. Should uh, we do the thing? Mm -hmm. Abraca, boom! I don't know how we did it. Wow. Pow, alakazam. It's in the ground. No bear's gonna get us now. Here's the inside of our tent, if you're curious. It's only missing one thing, Clark, man. What? A mattress. Let's give this thing a whirl and see how it is. This will never be this small again, ever. I don't want too much air in it though, because then I won't be able to get inside the tent. The moment of truth. I'm good. Oh, easy. It's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little too small, I think. Yeah, you gotta sleep way over on that side. I don't want you to. <laughs> All right, I'll take this whole thing to myself. Oh, this is great. It's pretty nice in here, Yami. This is where we'll be sleeping tonight. Comfortable? Yeah, it's super comfortable. Double heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. We'll actually put more air in this, so now it's fully inflated and it fit through here, and I rotated it this way, so when we lay in here, this bag before was kind of like in my business. Now when we lay in here, we can I feel like we have more space this way. And I'm pretty certain that we do. New setup, Clark, man. We're laying this yeah. way now. Oh, okie okay, dokie. Okay. I'm going to put you by the door. That way, if the bear comes, he takes you first. Hey! <laughs> you're sleeping over here, so the bear eats you first. Okay. Fire to make some s'mores. Ooh. Ooh! I think she heard that without the walkie talkie. I jumped down. Ow! <laughs> you think you still fit in this thing? Um, Let's I, do a test. I don't think so. Let's test it first. Oh my god. You still fit? Yep. Okay. Everything's in here all set up. I'm going to close this in so we don't have any bug visitors this evening. Yeah, let's do hill climb. You can do better than I did. Somebody bit a hole there. I dug a hole. <laughs> oh, it's, it's, it's so loose. Oh my gosh. I'm at the top. Nobody claims I'm at the bottom. I'm at the top. Down. It's looking good. It looks way cooler in real life than it yeah, does on it camera. Cool video of us kayaking, but <laughs> so many of them bring the damn kayak. I should have. Uh, help me, help me. You settle down over there. I've got big things happening here. <laughs> oh, yes. Mm. Mm. Jump? Mm -hmm. How do you make me kind of lie? I saw you. You saw me where you run all the way down there and jump? Yep. So, um, how'd you like the Wright Brothers museum? It was interesting. Clark Man's in. We're going to bed. <laughs> all right. I guess, uh, that's it for us for today. Hope you guys enjoyed coming along with us on Guys Week Day 2, our camping day. Good night, Clark Man. Good night, Dad.